right this is nifty and h1 chart as we discussed uh, yesterday that we are looking for buys from here and we are expecting that price was running like that and it will hit this uh, resistance line because uh, we draw a range so this is called a uh, range or you can say parallel line so exactly here you can see yesterday price uh, broke this level but they form a pin bar uh, somewhere here now you can see price today open a gap up and we are expecting that it will continue toward upside now let's see in a large time frame like daily first now you can see uh, bank nifty broke uh, previous high record so this is the previous high record uh, let me show you here uh, 8 30 2020 all right uh, that was a higher point around almost 25,000 something so today you can see price broke this level and we are expecting that it will continue from this area and let me show you next the resistance so here you can see this is the weekly chart and let me remove this one and let me draw a horizontal line by connecting this uh, moving averages now you can see weekly and next resistance will be around 26,800 so we are expecting uh, recently it will hit this level of 26,800 why is it important because we have seen multiple rejection in this area we have seen multiple rejection weekly in this area and here you can see this is the rejection and act as a support so that is where we are expecting that it will hit uh, this level all right and now let's jump to in a small time frame to find out some uh, entry point now you can see in this area we're going to apply breakout trading strategy so i think everybody know breakout trading strategy all right now let's see uh it's uh it's four chart this is h4 chart and now you can see price create a new high they're creating a new higher high just a minute higher high higher low higher high higher low and a higher high and the here you can see higher low and they will get a new higher high so in that case we will apply some uh, Fibonacci tools to find out some uh, resistance line all right and now jump to Fibonacci so let me show you uh, suppose this is a A point and this is a B point and this is the C point and we need a D we need D point. Where is the D point? So in that case, uh, I'll apply Fibonacci so like that, like that, and the next, uh, we're gonna apply Fibonacci. So I'm applying Fibonacci extension, and right now here you can see first level we have seen. Uh, this is called 123. This one 123 extension. I'm gonna draw a horizontal line by connecting this line. Uh, this is the resistance line. So remember, this is the first resistance, and almost there is second resistance. Let me remove this Fibonacci one. Now see, this is the resistance line. So we are expecting that price will hit this level. Okay. Now I can see here. So if you're gonna place buy order. So you just close your position around 25, 800. This is our resistance line. So we are expecting again price will give a correction. Some moving average will be there and that will be another buy opportunity. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.